That would be my answer, right? It's, it's like all of us know what we should do, but we get too busy in our daily lives to actually do things that are productive. So what this does is it centers you, it reminds you, and refocuses you on the things that you should be doing on a daily basis. And there's also this like um, this group camaraderie that happens, right? Where everybody's hearing it, you're all in agreement, and there's this power that comes from that, from that networking, from that, from that group think, where it's like, hey, we all know we need to do this. We're all in this together. Let's hold each other accountable. And that's why these things matter, right? It gets people, it refocuses them and gets them back on the right track on the things that actually matter, not just the things they're doing every day. So without further ado, Jared James. All right, guys. Nothing like a golf clap to get you going. You guys good? You guys tired? That was quite a meal, huh? It's the first time in my life I've ever had gravy before getting on stage, so. Competition is the best thing that ever happens to you, if you understand it. Competition always does, you guys should write this down, competition always does one of two things in your business. One of two things. Competition will either eliminate you or it makes you better. Those are the only two options you have. Competition eliminates you or it makes you better. I tell you, every time I see Jared, I realize that there's a trainer that has been through the thick and thin as an agent, and he sees it from a perspective that most trainers do not. So I really appreciate hearing from someone with his type of pedigree. The biggest thing I took away from today was Jared's suggestion on videotaping yourself and doing like a monthly market report. I thought it'd be fun to do maybe why should you have a inspection or why should you get a CMA or why should you get a survey also maybe possibly in the future what colors are popular what type of finishes people should use if they're updating or upgrading their homes and um, just mostly how he's just a very down-to-earth guy he's not he's not up in the clouds like some of them and that he's an introvert because I am as well. So that's what I took away from today. An event like this is great because sometimes when you're in the hustle and bustle of the business, things get stale. You don't, you know, you, you lose the time to think about innovation and all that stuff. So coming here, listening to Jared, stuff like that, we got some great marketing materials and marketing ideas that I think that we're going to be able to take back and implement right away. So it's always a great thing to come to, you know, events like this. But when you, when you look at it though, what actually happened that came from that is that our consumer was forced to all of the things that I've been telling you guys for years that you need to adopt, like video and technology and all that kind of stuff, your consumer now got used to it. The people in this room that build their library now, which lives on whether you create another video or not, are the ones who are gonna win not only now, but four years from now.